Hey guys, it's Devil. Welcome back to my channel. This is the Mass Effect 3 launch day. I am extremely excited for this. I've been very pumped up. Right now, I just got, I'm in already, in case anybody's wondering, because it's 9am where I am and I live in California, and the game doesn't come out till tomorrow for me. But, the game came out at 7am in Asia. So, I just had a download, the, I just downloaded a proxy IP hider, and made myself appear like I was in um, Asia. So that's how I got in the game, just so you guys know. This is the last two waves on bronze of the Solarian Engineer, which is my favorite class now. It is so fun to play. I played another game against the Geth, which uh, the servers crashed, so I'm not going to upload that, but he's not as good as against, against the Geth, but as against these guys, I'm sorry. He's not as good against the Reapers, but he is against these guys. He's amazing. Energy Drain. This is my favorite ability that this guy has. There's a couple different talent points in it. I haven't spec'd all the way. I'm only like level 10 or something or something like that in this video. Sorry, I'm going like a million miles an hour because I'm really pumped up. I'm trying to get these videos out for you guys a day early so you guys can see how, uh, what the game's like. But this is the get. Uh, that's a flame trooper that was just shooting me. This is a Solarian Engineer again. He's got Energy Drain, he's got uh, Decoy, and he's got Incinerate. Now, Incinerate is great against the armor targets, Decoy is get great against everything, and so is Energy Drain. There's a talent point in Energy Drain that you can either reduce the cooldown or increase the AoE radius by 50%, I believe, or 100%. I think it's 100, actually. I'll have to check on that later. But 100%, so it, 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 it's as good as overcharge, but the main difference is it gives you shields. Now, these guys, the Geth, like, all of them have shields, so it takes away their shields, gives you shields. It's the ultimate oh shit button. It's better than everything else I've seen so far. The decoy is also awesome. It wor it's worked on everything that I've used it on. Later on in the video, towards the end, there's the, la the last two waves. This one and the next one, especially, where I'm in the center here, and I'm holding off basically like 50 guys. I'm just decoying. See, I just use the decoy. Um, you see it better on down, later down the video, so make sure you pay attention to the whole thing. But these guys, the the Geth, they have some special abilities. They have the Geth hunters, like you can see right there, which stealth and have shields, and they try to sneak up on you a lot, like a phantom would. Then they have the Geth Primes, which are kind of like their atlases. They're big and armored and shielded. It incinerates really good against them. There's your Flame Troopers. They come in around round 5. I don't know what they're equivalent to, but uh, they, I haven't seen them kill anybody yet, so they're not that dangerous. He was just shooting my boy. And then they have the Geth Troopers, which is their basic trooper. There's a Geth Prime right there. It takes a lot of damage. But you guys can just watch the video and find out for yourself. I'm gonna stop talking now. I know you guys are excited about this game, so enjoy this video. When as soon as the game comes out, I have a lot of fun. Come back to my channel for more videos on this. I'm going to put up a video showing my first unlock for the uh, Spectre boxes. I'm gonna put up a video showing all the different classes as I unlock them, different fights. Um, I, I can tell you guys right now that the Reaper fights are pretty epic. They are some creepy motherfuckers. So, check back later. I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye.
Get in the zone. 